Hi friends, welcome to the Sub Bass YouTube channel. Just finished watching Arsenal's game against Luton last night. As far as I'm stands, I can kind of the world is is Luton three, Arsenal four. The goals okay, I'm old to tie the the goal scorers in order. First, Gabriel Martinelli scores, that was assisted by Bakaya Saka. And then the the, the Luton scored from a set piece is from Gabriel Arsha. Assisted by Alfie Doughty. Then, before half time, Gabriel Jesus scored, in, in which the cross was, was, was delivered well by Ben White. Then, after half time, Luton scored for, from, another, from another set piece, Elijah Adebayor scored, following from a corner assisted by Alfie Doughty. And that time, David Weyer made a mistake. Then, eight minutes later, Ross Barkley scored and that was assisted by Andrews Townsend, in which uh, David Weyer made another mistake. So in this game, da David Weyer made, made two mistakes in the game. Then three minutes later, Kai Havertz scores and that was assisted by Gabriel Jesus. Then we has to then we has to leave it late until the 90 plus seventh minute. Declan Rice scored and that was assisted by Martin Odegaard. Declan Rice scored his third goal for Arsenal, in which that was outstanding for Arsenal, and it was unbelievable from, from last night's game. Another great performance, but I believe that uh, Luton wanted to, win, wanted to beat us. But look, for Arsenal, right, we just want to stay in a title race because we have to keep on competing. We need to keep on winning games just so we have to stay in the top of the league. Other than that, in stoppage time, it was Vaki and Wilde, Declan Rice. If it wasn't for him, then we would have drawn 3 all. Because, look, of course, we want to stay unbeaten against the newly promoted side. But I remember one time, by it when he lost to Nottingham Forest in May. And, and that was when they needed to, was then, they needed to secure safety. And Manchester City won the title. Well, they deserved this because... William Saliba's injury cost us the title. So overall, at Kenworth Road, we have been fantastic. We've been absolutely fantastic. The we left it late to win to take all three points from Kenworth Road, and the fact was that uh, and uh, up until when they were relegated in 1992, Luton went unbeaten again. Luton were unbeaten against Arsenal. But then, since but then on the return to the top flight, we needed to end our winless run to beat the Hatters 4 3 at, the, uh, at Canworth Road. So, overall, our performance was great. Our win means that we are still at top of the, we're still at top of the league, five points clear from Liverpool and six points clear from Manchester City. And. Dell and they play against Aston Villa tonight, so my prediction for that will be is Aston Villa to beat Manchester City. Because they will be without Rodri and returning to Jack Grealish, who whom, whom both have picked up their fifth yellow card of the season. Next up we got is against Aston Villa away from home. So should we win? So should we beat Villa so should we beat Villa and then and then we'll stay in, in the top of the league for sure. Thank you for watching this video onto my YouTube, YouTube channel. Don't forget to like and comment on this. As well as subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you and God bless you all. Thank you so much.